Hello, hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Brave Fencer Musashi. So, when we last left off, we, uh, we need to go up Twin, Twin Peak Mountain, and, uh, a oh, restaurant just closed. <clears throat> uh, item space, what have we got? I gotta remember what the cancel button is. Cancel button is triangle. Oh, you can adjust the sound from there. Oh well, I've already got adjusted, it's okay. We'll go appraisal stuff later. We actually have reasons for not worrying about it right now. <clears throat> so yeah, we hadn't done anything off screen yet. There's really no point in doing it off screen right this moment. Since we found this guy, would you like to access, sir? Please go ahead. So yeah, we, he just lets us out. So, back to Twin Peak Mountain. Oh, in case you're curious, uh, throwing things with the triangle button, now that we have Lumina, throws them straight up, whereas throwing things with the square button throws them forward. So I can throw them up and hit them with Lumina like that. I think this guy still does a satiate too. Oh, there's something else I can do too. Ah, crap, missed. So, there's a counter system. If, okay, this guy may not be the thing I need to use it on. I'll use it on something else. I will show it off though, because it's very useful. I think you can do it at any time, just as long as you have Lumina. I want to say you have to have Lumina. Could be mistaken. Or I mean, Okay, so there's special abilities. I don't know why I said it like that. I, it's definitely you have to have Lumina, but I think you can do it at any time. I don't think you have to learn it. Uh, you don't actually attack, so... I mean, you do, but nowhere's near what I need to worry about. And we get... Mercenary Meatloaf! Yay, I'm free! Alright! Alright! Thank you! Thank you! I can't keep that up. Gotta go, gotta go. Bye bye, bye bye. That's the way he does that. The voice actor, you'll hear the voice actor later. He actually puts emphasis on the first part of a word and then the last part of the word after he repeats himself. Would you go away? I mean, seriously, go away. Hey, it's just... Ah! Water! No, I wanna... There we go. It's a memory box. Would you like to leave your memories here? Uh, sure. Leave my memories here! Your memories will be stored here. Your memories up to until now will be stored inside this memory box. If you use another memory box, or if you reset or turn off the machine, your memories will be erased. So it's essentially a quick save function. It allows you to have a restore point <clears throat> in the event. Hey, there's a Bush uh, Bushido field up there. Also, we found 200 drans and we feel that we deserve to keep it. And oh, that's a thing. We'll get to those later. Much, much later. Okay, I don't remember how to get to that Bushido field, but I don't think I can for a while. Oh, I bet it has to do with that. I think... Do I remember? Do I really? I think I do remember, actually. Oh, hello. I'm gonna work on building up Lumina here. Uh-oh. Okay, so, you see how the eyeball is starting to close a little bit? Oh, crap. The eyeball over there starting to close just a little bit. That means that I'm starting to get tired. I can't. I know I can make this. I've done it plenty of times. There we go. Old book. It needs to be appraised. But yeah, you see that if I if I pause, you see as tired as 53%. That's what it is. He's starting to get tired. So.
have to watch that. Okay, I made it across in one shot. I haven't found any trees yet. That's, uh, I saw one as we were going around, but I couldn't reach it. Uh, here's a hint. We have to get to that tree a different way. I'm trying to remember if I've missed any, though. I don't think I have. I hope I haven't. Be you know, maybe we ought to take a break here. There's no enemies in here, so we don't have to worry about getting attacked. We can heal up, and we can clear some of our tired. I think you can only sleep on the go like this and build up to 20% tired, I think. But it'll let us heal, so... BP, I'll just have to drain something. There we go. Ah, oh, crap. Come on. There we go. Oh, I'm being shot up from the background. That's what's happening. Is it... Right here? Ah, oh, there it is. Now. There, I landed on it. Haha. Uh -huh. Shepherd Beefalo. Have I been saved? But my sheep have all been slaughtered by Thirst Quencher. Why do they have to suffer? Poor sheep. Oh, pardon me. I'll go back to the castle now. Hey, we got more BP. Okay. Okay, so uh, while it's nice and safe, I'm going to heal a little bit. Yeah, see, it stops at 20%. So I was right, yay. Oops. Don't mind that loud banging noise. That was me knocking something over on my desk. <clears throat> Captivating, isn't it? Absolutely thrilling. I mean, I could have bought healing items. I could have, like the gels. <clears throat> I'm gonna wait for 130 or so. I'm not gonna full heal, just just up to. There we go. That'll work. All right. Switch back to sword boots. Jump. Woo. There we go. That's what this is. Also, that is. Ooh, hello. That's danger. I don't know what's over here. Let's find out. What's over here? Uh, a chest. And we get a dagger. It needs to be appraised. Okay, then. Ah! Actual lightning bugs with real lightning. Okay. Oh, Lord. Oh, come on. <laughs> I hit the jump button game. Okay, let those bullets go past. There we go. Yeah, I'm just gonna run by. We'll have plenty of time later, don't worry about it. Uh, PTSD of this area. There's a reason for that. Not right now, but there's a reason for that. Oh boy, is there a reason for that. So. Trees. Looks like I gotta put some oomph into this one. Looks like I gotta put some... By oomph, he means this. Still tons to go, literally. Literal tons. Kusashi is insanely strong. So yeah, we're just scaling the back of a dead dinosaur. That's a thing now. With a broken tail, too. I kind of feel bad for it. Slide down. I missed this Bidjo Field one, one playthrough. 
I missed it for a very long time. Knight Lardwick, thank you for saving me. I am Knight Lardwick, an expert on fencing. Oh, do you mind saving my younger brother, Soldier Lardwick? I believe he is somewhere on this mountain. I believe that he is somewhere on this mountain. Thank you, sir. Yeah, already saved him. We're good. And we've absorbed the Vincia Field, so more BP. And climb up. Away we go. Oop. You're good to build up my Lumina skills. Uh, -huh. uh I feel like we're aha missing something. Oh no! That ain't good. Yeah, I was gonna say because of the way I fell, I didn't never touch that middle platform. I'm just gonna walk over there. There we go. Now our reset points over here. Oh no. There we go. Oh hey. What's this? Eee. Oh look, another venture field. Wait, was it the one other one or wasn't it this one? Well no, because you have to get this one because the tree. I think it was the other one I missed. Yeah. Thanks a lot. I'm truly thankful. How can I repay you? Well, if you ever need help, come by the castle. See you later. I don't know if that's the guy that sounds like that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hope that was the right guy. Also, word power. BP, yes. That's the second log, two more to go. Almost there. Wow, I just outright killed that power. I mean, I'll take the money. Haha. Uh -huh. Oh, great. They're definitely responding. Run! I love that counterattack, by the way. That counterattack is brutal. Oh, okay. I get hit by two. You gotta be far enough back, you only get hit by one. There we go. Yeah, get some fusion experience. And get some Lumina experience. There we go. Attack so much. Better, better hit over to John. Yep, we got all four. Let's get up out of here, shall we? Ooh, money. No, wait, money. Thank you. Heart. I no heart. Help. Please, thank you. Okay. You know, I did get to use javelin. Hang on, I'll use you. Ah. How dare you? How dare you poke me? Oh, come on. Okay, he's getting, he's running at me the second I try to, to fusion him. So, there we go. Helps if I actually time it right, instead of being an idiot. 
Alright, let's actually use telekinetic javelins. Multiple hits. It's beautiful. Ah, oh, I should have assimilated a mint. I'm starting to get quite, uh, tired. Ah, oh, crap. The platforming is a little bit difficult in this game. Oh, crap. Yeah, see, like I said, a little bit difficult. Okay, you go that way. I want your power, though. Give me. There we go. Now we're not tired. Now, did I just go through the wall? The bone, whatever. Okay, game. Behave. There we go. Now you're doing it, Musashi. One rib at a time. There. Hey! Did you bring the four logs? John! Yeah, no problem. And the secret? Well, it's about the legendary armor. Legendary armor? So it's not about the five scrolls? You mean I came here for nothing? What a waste of time. See ya. Hold on. Your name's Musashi, right? Do you know about the legend of Brave Fencer, Musashi? A little bit. Yeah, a little bit. Well, ma'am, it's said that there are five pieces of legendary armor that Brave Fencer Musashi left behind, and each one has unique powers. Huh. Then I can get one of them in exchange for these logs? What a nice guy. No, no, no. One of them is hidden somewhere at the bottom of this river. That's what these logs are for. We're gonna build a raft. Great idea, pal. Uh-oh. Better not tell him I can't swim. Yeah, about that. Okay, it's done. Off you go, Musashi. Good luck on your new journey. Oh, boy. Ready to die? I guess I'm, I'm ready to die. Yeah, you steer the draft and make it raw jump. Every time it receives damage, you lose a log. Four strike and you're out. Happy rafting! There's nothing happy about what's about to happen. There is nothing happy about what's about to happen. This game likes to break up its uh, action RPG platformer with uh, arcade sequences. Now, it does it well, don't get me wrong. It's actually a pretty, pretty well done thing, but... Oh, Lord. These, these segments are... Hmm. Woo, hello. Oh, Lord, I just got hit. Oh, that is not good, getting hit this early. Oh, rocks, please go away. Falling in another day. I go, oh, no, that is not good. <laughs> That is very, very bad. Don't care that I'm not on the side of the money. Money does not matter. Actually, this is... Okay, it's about to get hard, but this is not too bad. We see we can't jump anymore, so we have to not get hit by anything. Oh no, I'm at one log. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Oh, please tell me this is enough. E. Oh no, <laughs> this is not good. <laughs> Jump for dear life. I made it. Oh, we made it. We made it. Oh god, I made it on the first try. I can't believe I made it on the first try. Oh. Okay, so, give me the box, and we get a bracelet. So, what is this bracelet? Well, don't know. Literally don't know, it has to be appraised. So, what was this way? I mean, while we're up here, we might as well explore, right? Oh. Hey, a bencho field! Hey, a chest I can't do anything with. Huh. We'll be back. Oh, we'll be back. In fact, I think we're at the ex actually at the entrance. Yeah, we're right here at the entrance again. 
and Twin Peak Mountain. Yeah, and Hell's Valley. So that area is called Hell's Valley. That's that uh that prison we read about. So okay then. Anyway, it's nighttime. Musashi's sleepy. Let's go get some sleep. It's uh, currently Saturday. I need to check in. There's a shop that does appraisals as well, and that's where we need to go. We need to get the equipment we just found appraised, along with everything else we found. Because the legendary armor is obviously the bracelet. I don't... Do we need any water anymore? I don't think we do, but I'm going to go ahead and grab some while I'm here. Might as well, right? Well, H2O. Who knows? It might come in handy. 5 BP is not a lot, but it might just save my life later on. Uh, year. You're the appraisal shop, right? Connor's Pawn Shop. Yeah. 11 to 4 close Monday. So, yeah, he's, he's open tonight. Good. Or open this morning. We're gonna sleep until morning. Welcome. Make yourself at home. Thanks. I think I will. That should be enough to yeah, fully heal us. Good. Would you like anything else? Yeah, I came to chat. What you got? Where did John escaped? I should make Mint's curfew earlier. <laughs> About that. Anyway, yeah, what you gotta say? Hi. Hey, man. Leno disappeared again. I wonder if he went off with his owner, John. Hmm. Okay, so we meet a guy that we have not met before. Who are you? I'm Musashi. What a disgusting shop. Ah, uh, be quiet. What do you want, anyways? I love this music, by the way. Anyway, what's up? Hey, good for nothing, John. Wish he'd bring real treasure. Okay, so John works with him. He's a fence. Will you appraise this? And we can appraise the old crown. Let's see then. Hmm, yes, yes. I see. Amazing. Cake pan. Old book. Comic. A hilarious comic. Dagger. A pointy weapon. Huh? Okay. Amazing. Pin knife. Has a knife. Can opener. And a toothpick. Bracelet. Large sized bracelet. Looks pretty expensive. The legendary armor. The L brace. Now you can climb certain walls. Yes. We now have the L brace equipped. And we can also sell him the stuff that we don't need. I've never seen a reason not to, so. That's all, Mr. Connors. Bye. Yeah, yeah. Oh my. Is it already time for this? There you are, Musashi. Hey, Mayor. I think something's wrong with the village. Steamwood is broken down. That administrator. Steamwood? Administrator? It has nothing to do with me, pal. Don't be ridiculous. This village, all of all you can eat kingdom depends on Steamwood. If this continues, Steamwood and the entire village will blow up. Pretty severe. Therefore, would you please go and see what's wrong? Please have a talk with the administrator. His office is at the top of the cliff near the gondola. Forest, the administrator is so insolent. Indolent. He won't listen to anyone. So I'd like you to use that sword to scare him a bit. Please save Steamwood. Okay, I'll do it. Let's take care of good luck, Musashi. We're counting on you. And just immediately go back to walking. Nobody's nobody's worried anymore. Musashi's on the case. Well, we're gonna make a quick speed stop here and save. For no real reason. Welcome. Make yourself at home. I believe I will. Let's uh let's just do a quick little uh save over here on file two. Gotta go, have things to do. Good luck. We'll check out the toy shop later, don't worry. Um Is it it's the other place on the line. Uh where or no wait, what that was the place. That was the place. You, medicine shop person. Grocer. Welcome. What do you need? Game shop. I need yeah, let's get a couple of gels. 
and I don't really need the sea drink. I might need the antidotes. I don't need them now, but it would not hurt to get some. And it wouldn't hurt to buy a thing of cheese for later. Much later. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and buy a mint and an antidote and a cheese. Because the, the cheese will get stronger as you do nothing. Steamwood's gone nuts? What a joke. Wow, really? You're just not worried, huh? Okay, I'll come again. Bye. I don't think jumping is any faster, but it just feels faster. Alright, so above the gondola, right? Well, let's go above the gondola. No, up. Up, there we go. And now... So, how this works is you alternate your square and triangle buttons, and you can climb the wall. Yo, buddy. Help! Steam one's gone berserk! Ah, it's gonna explode in 24 hours! Holy crap! Why are you running around then? Aren't you the administrator? Yeah, but I didn't ask for this job. Thought all I had to do was sit around all day drinking coffee. Hey, are you good at climbing trees? You don't look like the alphabetic type. Ha! Of course I'm glad good at climbing trees. And it's settled. You go to Steamwood Forest to fix the problem. Hey, pal, isn't that your job? Ouch, oh, my back. I think I put it out. Okay, okay. So, what do I have to do? Here you go. Steamwood's manual. Manual. It looks like a pain in the rear to read. Everything you need to know is in that manual. Hurry! You only have 24 hours left! You must go to the top of the cliff that's located in Steamwood Forest. Yeah, so the second you talk to him starts a timer, and we... That timer's very serious, by the way. It is exactly serious. So... Yeah, that might be why I saved the game. <clears throat> anyway. Off we go. No time to dally. Maybe dilly, but no dallying. This is Steamwood, right? I hope it is. Otherwise, I am going the entirely wrong way. Yep, it is. We're good. Welcome back to Steamwood. And we made a short jaunt into here earlier, but ow. Now, we're here for real. Ooh, hello. Jumping, by the way, gives me kind of like this short invincibility thing, so that's why I do it. <laughs> Oh no. I hit the wrong button, I hit X. Don't ever hit X. I'll, I'll check this all out later, don't worry. All right, this moment, I do not have time to kill. Ah, <sighs> Steamwood. Oh, Steamwood. A beautiful-ish blend of technology and this must be Steamwood. nature. What am I supposed to do? Oh, yeah. I forgot about that manual. Let's see. How to fix the steam leak. One, turn off valves in numerical order. Two, stand in front of the valve and press the square button to start. Three, the pressure gauge will arise. When it reaches the OK zone, press X button to stop the gauge. Four, if successful, the small valve gauge will rise. If not, it will decrease. 5. Repeat until the valve gauge is full. 6. Turn off the next valve before the valve timer reaches zero. 7. If the valve timer reaches zero, the previous valves will reopen, and you will have to start on the, from the beginning. 8. Now do a test run on this door. Hope you're ready for pain. This is... Okay, Steamwood's not that bad, but it's... There's no enemies. There, there's no monsters at all in here. It is just you and your ability to time things. So yes, this is going to be pain because it's me playing. 
All right, number one. Here we go. Here goes nothing. I'm gonna skip it from there on. But I'm gonna hit the circle button. I do love the music though. Yes. You can't skip his jump, but you can skip the line. And as you do these, uh, shutting these valves, uh, pressure steam jets uh, stop. Letting you reach other valves. So that's the whole numerical order thing, too. Some of them have steam walls like that. You cannot go through. You have to jump around like that. Now you might have seen that thing go down, it will go up before I get there. There's very... you can do it optimally, I think, to be able to not have that happen, but I have never really had that luck. There are a total of four floors. There's the bottom floor with nothing on it, and then each floor above that has three valves. They're not all in the same order, by the way. And falling is a common thing. Oh, God. Uh, making that jump to the left or right onto the pipe is so annoying for me. I'm going to end up failing, I think. I might be able to do pipe number four in 15 seconds, but it's going to be close. i got to get there first. Oh, that's five. It goes the other way. Okay. I'm just going to fall here. Aww. Oh, I didn't mean to skip that. I have to start again. Anyway, yeah. So, all three valves closed. There is no checkpoint, by the way. This is one of the points where the game is... It actually gets a little annoying... The raft is hard, you know, kind of hard, but it's not super bad. This, on the other hand, I don't really care for. <laughs> oh, it's easy right now. Uh, the jumps are a little bad, but... It has to do with the fact this was made before the, uh, the twin sticks were, so it wasn't made for full 3D movement. It's going to miss me again. Go figure. I could have probably held it. I think I actually have to loop around to the left next time. Up there. I guess theoretically I could fall from the next floor up, but... Almost overshot it. Oh, stop jumping. So five is over there, but six is right here. Yeah, uh, we have to go around this way to go to four. Notice how it's a bit faster. Oh, and I missed. That's fine. As long as I can get this valve filled, we're okay. Yes! And now we can go from here and go left to get to five. And now that gas or that steam valve has shut so we can go this way as well. Okay, the, the elevator is down at the moment. It should be oh shoot. Okay. There we go. Okay, so now it should be where it's going back up. And thankfully, they boost the timer while, uh, because of the elevator. So now we're going up to the last one. Same thing, I think I need to go the other Oh no, wait, that one shut off. Didn't it? Yeah, it did. Okay. There's seven. Oh, I hit it, but I was on the other side. Good. Okay, here we go.
Come on. There we go. Seven's done. Now, eight, I think, is on the other side. Because this should be nine. Oh, no, wait. Oh, no, it's just eight. It's seven and eight. I don't know. I thought it was nine. I have missed that jump, by the way, and it sucks to miss the jump to eight. Come on. Come on. There we go. Yeah, no kidding, Musashi. Oh, time to relax indeed. That is probably the hardest thing we're going to do for quite a bit now. <laughs> you know, one wonders something. Why in the world would you have a system that would close the vent if it had the potential of exploding and taking out the whole town with it. It makes no sense to me. Thanks a lot. I'm very impressed. Steam leaks that were occurring everywhere should be fixed. Now you can use this shortcut steam wood from my house. Feel free to use it anytime you want to. No more steam leaks, okay? Oh, and about that. I heard a rumor that a masked man wearing a cape did this to Steamwood. I still have heard that he's heading towards Twin Peak Mountain. I hope he's not up to any more mischief. A man wearing a cape? It must be Root Trick! He's gonna get it! An acquaintance of yours, eh? You might be able to meet him at Twin Peak Mountain. If you do, give him a skull and tell him not to trouble me anymore, eh? Did I see you do anything to stop the leak? Er, uh, whoops, I almost forgot. The mayor wants to thank you. She dropped by his house. Er, uh, well, I have to go now. See you later! And that's the way back to be able to quickly go through, or go back to Grillin Village without going through the rest of Steamwood Forest. But, now that we're not under a timer, let's go check out Steamwood Forest. We did do a little bit of exploration already, but we didn't go up here, we couldn't go up here. So, let's see, what's over here? Chest. An aged coin, needs to be appraised. Okay. Ah, stop. Okay, there we go. And I think that actually shut down all the defense, the steam defenses, didn't it? Yeah, it did. No, I want, I want, give. Thank you. It gave. Yay. Okay. And this is nothing. That's the one we were on already. We already, we've already been up there, so. Because that was down this way, if I'm mistaken. I am mistaken. Oh, wait, no, I haven't been up there. What's up there? Hold up. Hold everything. How do we get up there? How do I get up there? From over here? I thought I already was up there. What? Really? I see Bencho Field. Bencho Field! Okay. Who we got? Uh, Acrobat Sausages! Yahoo! I'm free! I can practice stunts with Clown Weenie again! Come by later and watch us! Well, I would love to, but I have to be able to get to the castle first. We did kind of slide down the gondola wire. Speaking of, we need to fix the gondola somehow. Hey, heart. Ooh, money. I see money over there. I like money. Oh, Musashi's getting tired. 500 bucks. I can't... I can't fall down. It's actually uh, like 500 yen. I, they just localizations back in the day had a had a tendency of just throwing a dollar sign on the things instead of a yen sign. We're not as rich as we think we are. Oh, hey, there's that crest and a wall we can climb, but we can't climb up. You might notice we hit our head right here. So yeah. Interesting, no? So yeah, we've been here the rest of the way, so we'll just run. And now everyone's not dying. Now well, we can go see the mayor. Is this the mayor's house? 
This is the mayor's house. Okay. Twirly bird. All right, mayor. Hey, buddy. Musashi, I was worried about you. Everything all right? You saved the Musashi, you saved the village. How could I repay you? Let's see. You might not like how this tastes, but it's good for you. Here you go. And we received a longevity berry. Max HP increased by 25. HP are fully restored. Hey, hey. Longevity berries. We'll be looking for those. Oh, hey. Hey, buddy. Sunshine is lovely, ain't it? Sure is. That was a close one. I thought my beloved collection of action figures was going up in flames. Oh, you collect action figures, do you? That's cool. Oh, speaking of, is the toy shop open? Hello, church. Um, but yeah, I didn't know. Is the toy shop open? Is it open on Sundays? I have no idea if it's open on Sundays. That's the appraisal shop. Actually, we probably need to stop in there. Toy shop is... This is not, sorry if I'm making anyone dizzy. Toy shop! We haven't been in here yet. Toy time! Hello. Hey, Kurt. Oh, no introduction? Oh, well. Get the top. Just between you and me. Many new action figures will ship in soon. Oh, cool. So. This is a thing you can do. You can just collect figurines. Um. Musashi. It has Lumina Infusion. Bee Plant. Soldiers. Root Trick. Steam Knight. Um, yes, I'm going to be putting money into this here. So, you know, I'll go ahead and buy a couple. I don't want to break myself, though, so I'm going to hold off on buying the rest. But I wanted to go ahead and buy the expensive ones there. And you can actually sell them back, but you can either collect them or you can play with them. Of course, once they're open, they're not worth as much anymore, but it'll be fine. Of course I'm going to play with them. I'm, I'm not the kind of person who just collects things and puts them on a shelf. It never made sense to me. Not that that's a bad thing. If you collect things and just put them on the shelf, then you do you. Yeah, I'm just yeah. not that kind of what person. And the ace coin is a gold coin. Colored A gold-colored game token of no worth in the Alakinian Kingdom. Well, shoot. Well, he can take it off me for 10 drans. It's okay. Yeah, yeah. I suppose it's technically drans, not dollars or yen. But drans are basically yen, so fight me. Um... Welcome. Make yourself at home. I believe I will. Thanks. Actually, hold up. Yes, I want to know. I want to save. We just did two really annoying things. I am going to save. Yeah, let's keep going. We're not done yet. Come on. We can't be done already. Although it is in the middle of the night. Can I get to the castle? Hold up. I need to find out if I can get to the castle. Or palace, whatever. Can you get to the palace? I think you can. Game acts like you can't, but you can. Yeah, okay, you can. It just, you go up the long, winding path, but you go back down the gondola by a wire when you first get here. Uh, the gondola isn't fixed yet, though. But, but, we can now talk to the people we've saved. So that's what we're going to do real quick. Sir Musashi. Why did thou come with hither? I would skip it, but come on. You can't skip Ribson. Also, I pre I really hope that people have noticed that everyone's names are themed. Because it's it's very obvious, but I feel like I really should point it out. Um Better go meet them. So if you've met them before, like I actually come and met them here, it'll say I wonder how they are. If you've not talked to them yet, it'll say better go meet them. 
That's how you can tell who you've spoken with or not. And now that we've saved Seer, uh, it's Beverly, but without the R, so it's Veal. It's Beverly, I think. Um, but according, because we saved Seer Beverly, now we know the general location of all the people, as long as they're, as long as they're places that we can be go to. If it says even Seer Beverly doesn't know, we can't get there yet. So, now we may not be able to get them still. Just because we know where they are doesn't mean we can get them. Because Hawker and Maid, we may not be able to access yet. But we can get to the zone that they're in. So, that's why it says that where they are. But the Bailiff, Taster, and Carpent B, Carpenter I'm assuming... Um, are in a zone we cannot access yet, and that's why even Seer uh, Beverly doesn't know. Uh, Weaver is in Twin Peak. I want to say it's a while before we get Weaver. Excuse me. Anyway, with all of that said, let's go meet Seer Beverly. Hi! The <laughs> that was really loud, I'm so sorry. The location of the five scrolls? What's that supposed to be? Oh, okay. Hubble, bubble, boil, and simmer. Hubble, bubble, chop, and skewer. I got it. The first scroll is on the top of a mountain. I think. Okay, bye-bye. Well, okay then. That was very helpful. The top of a mountain. Well, probably at the, the summit of, of Twin Peak Mount, if I had to guess. So, I mean, we're headed there anyway. Musician B. Did you hear it? Did you come to see me play? Thanks, I'll do my best. And now that we've spoken to them, now there's a flute in the background. I love that. That rescuing the musicians actually adds instruments to the, the music theme of the castle. I think it may affect Grilling Village as well. But I know it affects the castle palace. Just gonna stop and appreciate that for a moment. So good. Thank you for saving my brother. If I could be of any assistance, please don't hesitate to ask. Mercenary C. Thank you! Thank you! I'll do anything for you! Carpenter. Thanks, Tyke, for saving me. I'll return the favor anytime. Night B. Thanks for saving my brother. Always at your service. Huh. Shepard. Hey there, buddy. H hello. Thank you for saving me. I adore the endangered species, Minko. There are only 13 left in the world. They're so lovable, too. Yet, it's almost impossible to encounter them as they're nocturnal creatures. Huh. Nocturnal creatures, you say? I'll have to keep an eye out for that. Acrobat. Yahoo! Did you come to see my stunt? Watch closely. Uh, whoops, I forgot that Colin Wee's in charge. Please ask him. Okay, we'll have to go talk to the clown then. And that I think is all we have. Oh wait, there was a person there. Oh, Twin Peak. The doctor's in Twin Peak, okay. We don't have a doctor? Then how do I heal? Alright, clown. Come up hither. <laughs> Did you come to see our stunt? Okay, here we go. Oops, forgot we need an orange. Bring one the next time you come. Oh, is that all? I think we can manage that. Okay, we need an orange, do we? Hey, I'm coming to visit you, Ripson. Thanks to thee, nine out of the thirty-five people have returned to the castle. I missed a few words there and added a few words, but it'll be okay. 
Take good care on your journey. Thanks, Ripson. Bye. Okay, we need to grab an orange. This is important. Why is it important? Because I said it was important. <laughs> no, it's it's important for reasons. You'll understand entirely. Unless you've already played the game, in which case you already know, and it's, then it's not a secret at all. Ah, how refreshing. Can't I buy oranges? I can buy oranges, right? Pretty sure I can buy an orange. It's in the... not the grocer, oddly enough, but in the other... And now do we ride back down the gondola wire, or do we actually just walk, walk down the mountain? We walk down the mountain, okay. It's still like 6 in the morning. And not that place. It's the one on this side. I can never... I never keep this place in mind, right? 7 to 7, close Thursday. Okay. Wow. Also, it gets bright within 15 minutes. Welcome! May I help you? Sure can, Jam. What you got to say? I heard that you saved Steamwood from exploding. What a brave boy you are. Thanks, Jam. Game to shop. Can I buy... I cannot buy an orange from you. I am sad. Is it the grocer that sells it? Or do we just have to find an orange? I may have to find an orange. Hmm. I'm going to check the grocer, though. I don't remember her having any... Oh, wait. Oh, she opened a 10. Uh, well, okay then, I guess I'm just gonna fall asleep out in the middle of nowhere. As is my tradition, and I just got run over by a kid, and I didn't run over by another kid twice. Both kids have now trampled on my face. Welcome! What do you need? Do you sell oranges? You do not sell oranges. I have no use for any of you. Okay, apparently I have to find an orange. I'm sad. I'm very, very sad now. I'm so sad I'm gonna go beat up a cape guy. Actually, I was gonna beat the cape guy up regardless of being sad, but now I just have even more of a reason to beat up the cape guy. I really do like the cape guy. Root Trick is amazing. And if it's not obvious, uh, Thirst Quencher Empire is named after beverages. So. Just like basically everyone in All You Can Eat, if the, if the name wasn't as much of a giveaway as it could be, uh, is named after food. So Root Trick is root beer. Hope I haven't destroyed any of the magic for exposing that. way to. Oh, I almost knocked myself into the water. That would have been embarrassing. Ooh, hello. Do you get the satiate ability as well? Because I could use the BP. Yes. Yes, you do. I thought it was the same enemy. I wasn't 100% sure. Now, it's not permanent. It will wear off eventually. Whoa! Hello! Wait, you know what? That's a memory box. Why don't I put my memories back in there? Just in case, never hurts to have it. Oh, 
away we go. Hey, it's while we can. Why the game stop me? Ah! Hey, stupid! <laughs> huh? Musashi? I'll get only. you all for wrecking my darling steam night. Yeah, yeah. Where's the princess? <laughs> Y'all don't want to know. That's for sure. Oh, yeah. You... I don't have time to mess with you. Why are you saying you one of them five There's scrolls is me. just over them there? Oh. Can't have you my way. You know where the scroll what? is? There's a scroll nearby. Ah, shoot. You found it out. Last one up is a rotten egg. I'll see you later. Think you could beat me? Okay, I can just tap, can't I? Yeah. Wait. Does that come? I don't know if that comes out or not. I hope it doesn't. Ha! You're too slow upstairs to beat me, pal. Let's see. You know, whenever we came up, there was nothing there. But somewhere, he found a rock. I'll get you. And I'm pretty sure that was straight up murder. What? With Rutrik out of the picture, I can finally get the scroll. Yeah, no, straight up murder. Ooh. Hey, we've seen that symbol. This is one of the scrolls? It looks pretty metal. And by that I mean it looks metallic, it doesn't look like a scroll. Um... Oh. That was a squeaky noise. Musashi received the Earth Scroll. You can cause tremors, which will temporarily stop your enemies, and cause certain types of boulders to fall. What was that? An earthquake? Earth scroll has been absorbed. What the... the, the sword? Lumina talks? I am not... Talking. Telepathic communication. This is creepy. Destroy the Crest Guardian. Huh? What's that? What's a Crest Guardian? He is protecting a Crest. Well, that makes sense. A Crest? Not too clear on this. But anyways, I need to kill it, right? Hmm. Hey, Lumina, maybe you know where it is. Oh, it clammed up. Eh, who cares? Guess I'll have to ask someone at the castle. They'll help. Well, okay then. And now... Now we can have some fun. So, you can equip normal, which is what we're equipped with. But now you can also equip Earth. This is when the game starts getting interesting, in my opinion. It's all fun and games, but now we have magical powers with our sword. So now we can stun enemies, I believe. Uh... Oops, oh, too early. I don't remember. Yeah, you can still counter. Good.
Oh. Fine, I'll get fusion levels then. Alright, so back to the castle then. Hey, Luna leveled up. Nice. Uh, what level is... Luna, okay, yeah, I need to get some experience on fusion. I remember now... Yes, I do remember how to get the one here. It is gonna be a while. Excuse me. Yep, excuse me. Pardon me. Oh no. I found water. Go away. Go in the water. I'm trying to think. Do we have what we need? If we have what we need. Oh, hey. Hey, where were you, pal? Uh, well, I had things to do, you know? By the way, Musashi, how's your journey coming along? Thanks to you, I got the Earth Scroll. Oh, yeah, I forgot to return the treasure to you. It's called Elbrace. It's supposed to have some kind of special power. No, that's okay, Musashi. You should be equipped with the legendary armor. You must collect the five scrolls and bring peace to this world. Thanks, John. All right. Thanks. Oh, yeah. Do you know what Crest Guardians are? Crest Guardians. They guard the crests, which can only be set free by the corresponding scroll. Perhaps because you took the Earth Scroll, a Guardian will awaken in Hell's Valley. If I crush the Guardian, then I can free the crest. And when each crest is liberated, luminous power will increase. Whatever, pal. So, all I need to do is pulverize the Crest Guardian and free the scroll, right? That's right. Well, off to Hell's Valley. See you later. Wait, hold on. That place was once used as a high security prison, and it's still controlled by the palace. It's not that easy to get access, man. Oh, yeah? Then I'll go back to the castle and ask the geezer. John, what are you gonna do? Man, I don't know. I guess I'll start searching for the next treasure. Good luck, Musashi. Let's go, Leno. Good luck, John. Oh, well. Whoops, almost forgot. Gotta go to the palace and get permission to go into Hell's Valley. Absolutely. So, let's get on with it. The is not fixed yet, though, so long way it is. I can't remember how you get the gondola fixed. I honestly don't remember how you get the gondola fixed. I, okay. I might remember. I think I remember something, but... God, it's been so long since I played this game. I don't remember much, aside from bits and pieces that are like PTSD. Moments of the game that I'm dreading playing, but also looking forward to getting to. Because there are some genuinely good moments. A little sad that Rootrix over so quickly, though. Okay, so we're already at 31% tired. I'm gonna go ahead and sleep to... But sleep in the room, because it's free. There we go. We should be at 0% tired now. And now we can go talk to the geezer. Visit. I had to think about what command I was looking for. I was like, wait a minute. Hey, geezer, how do I get in Hell's Valley? What? Thou sayeth Hell's Valley. I understand it. I'll prepare everything. However, there's a problem. What kind of problem? 
We don't have enough people. I don't need help. I can do it myself. You need us four people to open the gate to Hell's Valley, because four switches must be pressed simultaneously to do it. Thus, I need thou to find the people that will help you. It should be in the areas you are able to explore. The ones that could help you from the people that are already saved are Soldier Lodwick, Mercenary Meatloaf, Carpenter Carby, Knight Lodwick. We have it four people! Sir Musashi, the preparations to go into Hell's Valley are complete. I told the team to wait for thou at the entrance to Hell's Valley. Cool, this is so exciting. By the way, Sir Musashi, why dost thou need to enter at Hell's Valley? Huh? You mean you don't know? Well, of course not. I does not be a nosy person. I'm gonna go pulverize the Crest Guardian and free the Earth Crest. See you later, geezer. Good lucketh. You know what? I just remembered. I do remember finding the orange. I remember finding the orange. Yep. Oh well. Suddenly, morning. I guess the flute was already there now that I'm thinking about it. Ah well. It adds flutes to the uh to the main theme, that's all that matters. Jumping up hills. I go fast? I cannot go fast. Why do I have to talk to you? Ah. Thank you, Lumpwood. Bye. I wonder... You know, I don't think he actually references food. I mean, John doesn't either, but... We also don't know John's last name, so... Now, Carvey, on the other hand, is because of Carve. You know, like to cut meat. So, let's make these boulders fall, shall we? Don't jump at them. You have to be on the ground so the cutscene can start. Yeah, knitter. This is the knitter. This is not the weaver, though. Uh, I forgot to say our previous line of all. I didn't think it was possible. I'm really happy about it. Let me tell you something. Legendary cloth exists somewhere in this country. It's supposed to have miraculous powers. Legendary cloth. We'll have to keep an eye out for that. Absorb the power from the Bencho field. Yay, BP. Okay. Now, we can't get that treasure chest for now. That's going to be a while before we can get it. But... Mind increase, nice. Welcome, Sir Musashi. We will immediately open the gate to Hell's Valley for you. And help in the battle. Yes, we will, yes, we will. All right, let's go to Hell's Valley. I kind of got the brothers' voices mixed up, I think. Oh well, it'll be okay. Alright, so what are we fighting? This is Hell's Valley? Uh, is something supposed to happen here? This is definitely the place. Right, Lardwick? Yes, it is. I will state our battle plan. After the enemy comes, you must drop the objects that we place in the bucket above you. Yeah, and if you drop them from this height, the monster will be mince me. And when it's unconscious, smash its core. That'll destroy him. Destroy! Destroy! However, if one of us is injured, we temporarily won't be able to assist you. Don't worry, I won't let that happen to you guys. It's here! It's here! Man your post! Does someone call for a boss? Because here it comes. Crest Guardian, Skull Beyond. Okay. 
We can't do anything to it ourselves. We have to utilize their buckets. Ow. Ah, oh, crap. He interrupted me. Ow. Bombs scatter and do minor damage to him. Bombs are not the most preferable weapon, but they do decent. Once he's taken enough damage, he will actually be frozen. Oh, rocks are great. Oh no. You see that antidote in the bucket? There's a reason they do that for you. After all, he is a earth-based creature, and earth is often related, well actually water is usually done with poison, but in this case, earth is poison. Because of the whole natural toxin thing. that buddy oh if he goes to climb up you have to knock him down I just hit myself with a bomb oops I was trying to be fancy and jump over with the earthquake thing I don't need that, guys. Okay, that didn't poison me. Good. Ooh, that ain't good. No. No, you don't get to do that. Oh, he actually landed on the rock and it damaged me. Nice. could do that. That drill thing he does with his tail is what poisons you, by the way. Ooh, nice. They hit him on the way down. It's so cool when that happens. Uh-oh. Charge over here. Aw. Aw, he stepped on my hand. Jerk. Run. 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 Okay, should be three. Yep, there he is. That's fine. Do what you gotta do. Bonk. Eat bombs. Okay, run behind him. Let's drop this on his head. Bonk. Yeah, that hurt, didn't it? No, you don't. You're not messing with my friends. Okay, you. Actually hitting with it. Nice. I have never actually done that. No. There you go. You're mine. Uh 
Uh, he just blew up the gate, too. Musashi received Sculpion's core. The Earth Crest has been limited, liberated. Limit level has increased. Max BP increased by 25. Ailments are cured. How refreshing. Congratulations, Sir Musashi. The plan was a success. Success! You'd be a great carpenter. Carpenter, carpenter! Couldn't have done it without you guys. Why not head back to the palace and get some rest? Victory! Thirst Quencher Empire. Ah, that idiot! Ludwig was so close to having the scroll! I'm so sorry, Fuhrer Flotsky, but Mission Bandy will not fail. What is that? What is Mission Bandy? The long-running research on upgrading Vincholoid soldiers has finally been completed. And using the results, we'll, like, have some fun with Musashi. <laughs> well, I hope so, darling. This better not waste my valuable time. I have nails to well, anyway, do what you can, darling. Oh, be quiet, sis! I'll show you! I can do it, like, if I really put my mind to it! <laughs> well, we will see what happens. We want our beloved ex-emperor to be proud of us. As long as we have Lumina and the Five Squalls, we can rebuild our empire! Bubbles, I am counting on you. Capricola, can I count on you too? <laughs> yes, you may, Fiora. Did he just correct his emperor's grammar? Mission Vanby, Chapter 3. What's a Vanby? Uh, we're about to find out. I have a bad feeling something is wrong with the village. But I want to do some side questy stuff. I want to show off what this crest is all about, after all. This music is really good, by the way. As to be expected of Square, I mean, come on, guys. They have amazing music. They hire very good composers. So back in Steamwood. There was that path that we couldn't go down. Or we couldn't do anything at because of... The this. Now, this is lit up. The Earth Crest. Stand upon the crest and use the Earth Scroll. Since we've busted the Guardian, this now is empowered. And allows us to use the full power of the Earth Scroll. Yeah. We just took out a cliffside. I don't even remember what's up here. I just remember wanting to do this. Oh, it's one of these things. Oh, hold still. There we go. When you pick one of those things up, you get the longevity berry out of its mouth, essentially. Oh, what's this? The wind crest, protected by a crest guardian. Oh. Okay, then. Well, we can't finish that anytime soon, but we got a longevity berry, so it's worth it. So, yeah. Anyway, back to town.
Music's here in town, too. What's going on? Hello? Hello? Welcome. Make yourself at home. Hey, what's going on, buddy? My brother begged me to help out at the inn. All right, nice guy. Oh, this is Motello, not Hotello. Huh? Well, what's going on? But that'll have to be for next time. Ha <laughs> ha! Cliffhangers. Yep. So when we come back, we're gonna find out what in the world Mission Bambi is. And we're going to find out why the music's so eerie and epic. And why Motello is here instead of Hotello. Yeah. But until then, we hope to see you again. Later!